What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's having a great Memorial Day weekend. As promised, as I told you in previous videos, here's the mystery box I promised for this Saturday evening. It's a box I pulled off of Pristine Auctions. Uh, around $90, I think I paid for this when it was all said and done through the bidding process. It's an all-sport mystery box that has 75 cards per box. With uh, This is number 87 out of the 100 they made of this product, Series 1. So it leads me to believe there's going to be a Series 2. Which offers, not a guaranteed, graded cards, vintage, rookie, insert, parallel cards. Some game used, some pack certified, autographed, authenticated autograph cards, some factory sealed packs. And a bonus card from sportscards.com. So I've been, I got this a couple days ago in the mail. Been holding off till today to open it. There's nothing else on the box, just all the wrapping and stuff that comes with it. So I've been chomping at the bit to tear into this. So let's do it. Let's see what we can find. See if it was worth it. Hopefully there's some great stuff in here. Haven't really seen much on the internet about this product. So... Maybe one of the select few that actually opens it for the first time. So let's get in here and see what we can find. A piece of tape. Hopefully there's some graded cards in here of some value. If we can get this tape open here. There we go. Get this off to the side. Yeah, there we go. So, oh, oh there's some... Uh, Screw down some one touches and everything in here. That's the plastic that comes with it. I guess I get a every card's a winner, it's a bonus card. So I guess I'll see what that is after the video. Let's uh, get in here and see what we can find. Don't see a graded card in here. But for some reason they have I guess this is in a hard case. Emmett Smith. Look at that. Dallas Cowboys. I'll scratch the hell on the casing though, but I don't even know what year this is from. 1994 experience sneak preview card. So, huh, not sure, but if it's in this case, has to have some kind of value to it, I'm hoping. I don't know if that's part of the card design, looks like it is, but it's really heavy in there, so it's nice. That's the box. Put that down to the side. I'll throw old good old Emmett Smith up here at one of these card holders as it's falling down. As my arm, my shoulders tweaking. Me trying to put it up here. Let's see if I can get it balanced right. All right. So here we go. Let's uh, get into this first stack and see what we have. So we got this and a screw down. 2000. Tops. Shaquille O'Neal, Magic Johnson, Tops Forever MVPs. All right. We got this little plastic here. Good thing about these, it appears they all come, well, I wouldn't say they all come in sleeves, but they don't. Some of them do. Got a Tom Brady icons. Oh, let me grab some of these here. Kind of disappointed I didn't get any graded cards, but. 2009 Upper Deck, Tom Brady, Lindsey Hunter, Dave Bergman, John Gray, got a Vinny Castillo, Bowman Chrome, Lonzo, and Yamir Yager from 2014. Hmm. Roger Craig, Bruce Smith, pretty old, Al McAdam, this is the 81-82 tops, grooms, Chris Weber, Weber, I'm not sure if that was their die cut, die cut version of the card back in the day, Michael Jordan,
from the what's it that the 98.99 upper deck set. It's pretty nice. Willis McGahey, Panini Prism. I'm sure, I'd sleeve up the Jordan before I sleeve up that one. EJ Emanuel. Cam Gallagher rookie. Top gallery. And then Tate. Alright, so we got a cologne. Who's this? James Will Wilder Jr. Tony Romo. 2015. TJ Watt. Tracy Porter. A checklist card. All right. Some of these vintage cards are actually in pretty nice shape. It's in 78. Reverse. That's worth. Dillard. Don Hood. It's actually pretty nice shape for a 1975 card. 46 years old, if I did my math correctly. Cincinnati Reds. The Cal Ricken. 1995 Don Ross. That's actually Frank Tarkenton. Ken Anderson. Mike Bragg. Bo Jackson. There you go. Not his rookie, but it's from the 88 tops. Mariona Rivera. 2003. There you go. Mario Lemieux. Score. 1990 score. Not sure if that was his rookie year or not. Kim Olajuwon. Oh, look at that. Johnny Bench. Corners kind of dinged a little bit from 1982. It's nice. Any complaints about that? 1982, Don Ross, Johnny Bench. All right. So, wow. Okay. So we got Cal to Greatness, the Shriek. Nine out of fifteen. Look at that. I got a Buck Leonard legendary lineage. Four hundred thirty-five out of five hundred and fifteen legendary cuts. Oh. Kind of interesting. What? Legendary cut, but I don't see. This looks like a normal card. I think it requires a one touch, though. But 2007. 2007. And we got a pack from the 1992 Upper Deck Series 2. Some 91, 92 OPG. And we got the bubble gun still in there. Interesting. Wayne Grexy's around that time frame. And we've got 88 tops. Real ones. So, uh, yeah. No autographs. No vintage wear. No nothing. I think I kind of, kind of gypped out of this box so far. I'm not sure about that Emma Smith. But, you know what? I'm going to rip into these old packs and uh, see what we can find. Doesn't seem to be searched. There's the bubble gum. Woo! Can't pay me enough to eat that right now, especially being from 1988. Let's see what we can find. Jeff Reed, Mark Davis, Stillwell, Gernhardt, Red Sox, Robert Bylevin, John Franco, Josh Jones, Terry Leach. There you go. So we got that. Save the hockey for last. 1999 Upper Deck. Find 500 game used back cards and jerseys cards. All right, well, let's take a chance and see what we can find. Oh, man, these cards are all they don't slip and slide like the other ones. Tony Bastista. Jeez. 
Come on now. Jason Kindle. The backwards card. Gutierrez. Trotnik, my lord, come on. Jamie Wright. Jeez. All right, let's see what this backwards card is here. Oh, it's just a checklist, unfortunately. Scott Brocious. Man, that's an old name. Damon Miner, star rookie. Greg Vaughn. All right. So I'll get us, we'll get into this uh, OPG hockey, 1991-1992. I know Wayne Grexy's rookie card just sold for over $3 million the other night. So it'll be interesting. Some chewed up gum in there. Whew. This thing's last ages. The Red Army. Cortinal. Uh, Blake, star rookie. Brickland. Ken Hodge. Doug Brown. John Collar and Kevin Stevens. All star. All right. Well, I don't know. <laughs> the verdict's out on that one. I guess I'll have to go back and see what this bonus card um, gives me. Maybe it'll be the big hit that I was supposed to get in this. But I didn't get any autographs, no patch cards, none of the. What the box tried to say, it kind of give me. Got some factory sold packs, but yeah. Barely anything of, of value. I just have to go back and see what these these cards are actually if they're worth anything. I'm not too sure. I guess I don't think they require a screw down or a one touch for these. I guess the value is in the and this is 21 years old, but I don't know if it holds any value. But I guess I get this big Thick card holder. Just limited edition 1994 NFL preview card for Emmett Smith. So hopefully it has some value. I'm not sure. It looks pretty uh pretty nice card inside, but I'm definitely gonna take it out of this this mistrustery of a card holder and pack it correctly. So thanks again for stopping by. Enjoying this little rip of this mystery box. Um, I'll leave the opinion out to you guys what you think the if it's worth it. Uh, if you buy one of these off pristine auction or not, but it was worth a shot at the time. But thanks again for watching, and I will uh, catch y'all tomorrow night. See ya.